This is the Shonet, it says Shonet OEM kit. Let's have a look inside. This is the Shonet OEM kit. So what do we have? First of all, we have the Shonet board itself. That's the Shonet board. Um, it's pretty small, you can see it has the SD card stuck in here where you can store your own and custom ILDA animations and frames onto, for example, for standalone operation or for DMX trigger or whatever you want to do. That's the one. The next board is the ILDA switchboard. This one allows for using the laser with external ILDA signal or with an internal show net. It automatically switches. So if you connect an external ILDA signal, it will prefer that external signal over the internal signal. But if there's no external signal, it will use the show net features for the laser operation. So this one. Then we have the mode selection board. With this board, you can select the different operation modes, you can set the dresses, you can set the behavior of the show net. So a very important part of the show net to just be able to address all the different features inside the board. Then we have the LAN connector, RJ45 connector um, with a micro match connector where you can directly uh, link this to the show net board so it's easily adjusted, uh, attached here. <clears throat> then we have the connection wire from the show net to the LDA board. So it's basically the internal signal distribution. Then we have a connection wire from the show net to the dip switch board. And then we add another wire. It's an open wire. Uh, on one side we have the micro match connector. The other side is open. This is for the DMX connection. You can solder this one to your DMX connectors. Anyway, you don't have to because the board also runs without DMX, but if you want to use DMX, then you can just simply wire this together and get going with DMX. So that's it. The board is empty. This is the Shonet OEM kit.